see what's on the agenda this morning. Make videos. Alright now. Okay. Welcome to a brand new episode of Noms. Now it's been a while since I've done one of these and as you can see my setup's kind of changed. Uh, I got a new chair at the beginning of the year and um, I started shooting stuff with my uh, my camera <laughs> as opposed to my phone. So if I do many more of these in the near future we should have much better quality and probably a much better time. So what have I been up to uh, in the last few however long it's been since the last episode of Norms? Well, I've kind of changed my diet a little bit. Uh, about a year ago I stopped drinking fizzy drinks, like outright, um, mainly because I was noticing it was really affecting my body in ways that were quite negative. Um, and yeah, I've just basically been trying to lower my sugar content, lower my salt content, and basically just try and uh, live slightly healthier. Uh, it's kind of worked. I've stopped doing fast food as well for the most part, which means no KFC, none of that kind of thing. Um, but that doesn't mean that there aren't many new wonderful food products that I'm going to be trying out for you, the viewers at home. Case in point, I went to Tesco yesterday and uh, yeah, there was a very long queue because of quarantine and all that kind of stuff but I managed to get my usual daily stuff and I needed to get some new tea bags because another thing that's kind of happened over the last year or so thanks to my partner Sarah I am now like addicted to tea um, specifically Yorkshire tea and a while back they released a new series of tea which included Yorkshire tea multi biscuit brew tastes like tea with biscuits now, I don't know about you, but I love dunking a biscuit in my tea. Uh, I'm a sucker for a bourbon or a chocolate chip. Um, bourbons are actually really nice to dunk in your tea because the chocolatey filling goes all slightly melted. <laughs> uh, I don't know about these. Uh, I've been putting it off because I'm kind of one of these people that's like a no fuss, no muss kind of thing. Uh, but they were on sale, so I thought I'd try them. It says on the back here, Here's a miraculous tea that tastes like biscuits, because when those two flavours combine, the resulting deliciousness creates a wave of happiness big enough to power an entire human being. <clears throat> it's a magical mug of biscuity goodness that doesn't get crumbs on your jumper. Okay, uh, now I've just had my breakfast, uh, had my cereal and my juice. But I've, I've held off for getting my tea to record this video. Uh, it's just your usual black tea with, it says here, natural flavouring. Rainforest Alliance certified. Well, I never. Uh, this is 40 tea bags, so probably won't last as long as my usual bigger boxes that I usually get. Because I, I kind of fluctuate between regular Yorkshire tea and Yorkshire Gold because oh Yorkshire Gold is just so so good sorry I got sidetracked there for a minute but anywho I'm gonna go make myself a cup of tea I'll be back in a minute well I'm back uh, with a cup of tea in tow in my favourite mug and immediately I can smell the biscuits uh, I gave the tea bag a nice big sniff before putting it in, and yeah, it did have like a subtle maltiness, but this, it's not just like a malty smell, it's a biscuity smell. I, I can't pinpoint which kind of biscuit, but it's definitely a biscuity smell. Uh, I left the bag in for about four to five minutes, which is what was recommended. Popped a bit of milk in there and a little bit of sugar, because, you know, I'm basic like that. And uh, yeah, it's, uh, it doesn't look any dissimilar from regular tea, but the smell is definitely a biscuity smell. 
So here we go. I hope I don't burn my mouth out with this. I've had a lot of practice. Oh. Oh. Okay. That's very biscuity. Like, it's like they've made tea out of biscuits. Wow. You know how you get, like, broken biscuits? You know, the bags of broken biscuits? And some of them are quite are softer than others, you know, because like, they've been left out, what have you. That's what it kind of tastes like. There's, there's kind of like a hint of coconut. Like, the biscuits they decided to, to replicate with this cup of tea is like Nice biscuits, I would have thought, is the closest, because that is... it's strong. I'll, I'll, I'll say that much, it's very strong. Let's try again. Wow. It's like you can taste like a... I don't know, like a layer of... I don't want to say like a layer of chocolate, because it's not. But that's very biscuity. I suppose that's what I should really expect, <laughs> considering that, that it's tea and biscuits tea. Uh, would I have this every day? Uh, probably not. Um, it's an odd taste to get used to. But as a novelty, if you like to have a friend round, and they were like, oh, do you want a cup of tea? Yeah, okay then. I mean, obviously after, after the world's gone back to normal. Um, but yeah, if you were to surprise somebody with this without even letting them know, it would, it would be, oh wow, this is very strange. I love you Yorkshire tea, but this is weird. <laughs> uh, oh, yeah, I'm not, yeah, I'm going to drink the whole thing uh, once it's cooled down a bit. Um, and I'll certainly finish the pack. Uh, and I, I recommend it. Uh, if you're looking for something a bit weird, a bit different to uh, pass the time, especially during what's going on at the moment, uh, yeah, if you want to try something different, if you just don't fancy a biscuit, uh, like they say on the box, you don't want crumbs on your jumper, then uh, yeah, this is definitely something that I recommend. Uh, yeah, thumbs up. So, right, best, uh, how do I finish this? Well, I'm not going to drink all this now because it's very hot. Let me just put it down. <coughs> right, okay. If there's any type of food, snacks, what have you, that you'd like me to try out, please feel free to leave it in the comments below. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Maybe ding that little bell. I'm not entirely sure what it does, but apparently it's important. And uh, yeah, I will see you on the next episode of Noms. And remember to eat all the snacks. Right, see you later.